What's up everyone? This is the Bar Soap Man Canada. Today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a different type of uh, video. I'm actually responding to one of my followers and one of my subscribers request to see my bar soap and my body wash collection. And that's exactly what I'm going to do today. I'm going to just show you where I keep them, sort of what I do with them, my originals that I had. And uh, just a quick brief thing here, like um, for all of you that don't know me, I do live in Canada. Um, living in the province of Ontario, Canada. Uh, right now we just are recovering from winter time and uh, it's spring and it's beautiful. I am in uh, one of my basement bedrooms down here and this is where I shoot most of my videos, right there in that little corner. This is the soap and accessory corner, if you will. Um, so yeah, I come down here because it's sort of uh, noise free and I get to, uh, do my thing and I get to keep my soaps here. So to answer one of my followers and subscribers uh, question, what do I do with my bar soap? Where do I keep it? Well, I'm gonna flip the camera around here and I'm gonna show you exactly where I keep my bar soap. So that is where my bar soap is kept. Now this is the majority of my soap. All right, so my original bars were the Zeus, the, um, Art of Shaving, which I have not reviewed yet. Uh, I just don't want to because it's so expensive now. The Method. I had, uh, if you remember, one of my original videos, I did some Dr. Squatch. I also did some Everyman Jack bars, which I no longer own. But over the last year, I have added so much to my collection. These bars are from a uh, family friend. She owns Daisy and Baloo. I'm going to be reviewing those bars very soon. Uh, and basically, this is it. This is my entire bar soap collection. I have a few more in my washroom, which I will show you. And I'm running out of room. I'm running out of room. This is where I keep my body washes on the side. All of the other ones that I've opened up and that I've used, uh, I just give them to my father uh, or my mother. Uh, I bring them over to their house and I let them sort of finish them off but yeah this is what i do so quite a few of these soaps are open so the allen berries the gentleman quest the harry's the moisture blast in the back the via mercado that is open um I, I i sometimes will put them in a ziploc bag but then i really don't like the way the ziploc bag looks on here i like the way you know the display looks just like this so what i'll do is generally most of these bars if you look at the back they are good for, I'll give you an example here. There you go. Look at this, guys. So 36 months. Do you see that right there beside the 250 grams? It says 36M. That means when this container is open, it's good for 36 months. So a lot of these will not expire for the next two or three years. Um, I picked up a few new body washes here, and I can't wait to use them. Those are pretty exciting. I picked up a couple of new uh, bar soaps, which I can't wait to use, this one and this one. And this is basically what I do with it. I leave them here. I just let them sort of cure and make my room smell amazing. Now, follow me. Walk with me. Ignore the mess. I have two little kids. I have two little kids. Let's go to my washroom. My basement washroom, that is. Hello. Up here, I have some of my other stuff that I just decided to display uh, in my washroom. That's the Molten Brown stuff and, you know, the Bulldog and just a couple of other bars that I've used. And they make the washroom smell really good. My shower also has some <laughs> bars in there, which my wife will come down here and use and whatnot. So in general, when you see me making my soap videos, now you have a general idea of where I am and what I'm doing. Now, would I recommend that if you're if you have a specific soap that you like, maybe you should vacuum seal it or put it in a Ziploc bag? Yes, for sure. Me personally, I use all my soaps. So what I do is I pre-record some of the videos sometimes, and then there'll be a couple days where I'm no longer using that product, and I'll go back and I'll use one of the products that I opened originally. I'll finish that one off. A lot of these bars, they're gone in three, four days. I take to sometimes three showers a day, depending what I'm doing. One in the morning, uh, one after a workout, and then sometimes one after work. Um, is it a lot of showers? Yes, but when you're the bar soap man Canada and you gotta go through these bars, um, you find excuses and reasons to shower. So I hope that clarifies um, a lot of the questions that I got about my soap collection, 
about how I store my soaps, guys. I don't do anything special. Whenever I put the bar back in the pack, I make sure it's clean. I wash it under the water, get any, you know, sort of leftover suds off. I dry it. I let it air dry for a couple days, and then I put it back in the pack. So to give you an example, Harry's, I did this review a couple weeks ago. The bar is totally fine. It's normal. Oh, my God. Guys, I really wish you should try this bar. It's amazing. Um, so that's what I do. I just keep them in, on my shelf as display. And if there's something that I really can't find anymore, I will always keep the box. I will always keep that box. You guys let me know in the comments down below if I should be doing anything different. If there's any concerns that you guys have based on what you see. I know there was uh, one comment on my YouTube. She absolutely blasted me about using a loofah and how I store my bar soaps and how uh, the travel containers... Uh, are good. Now guys, these are good for traveling. They're good if you're going to the gym. I use a soap saver, a wood one or a ceramic one, which I wash pretty much all the time. Um, that's just my routine. What you see is what you get. I don't do anything fancy with them, but that is the life as the Bar Soap Man Canada. Anyways, folks, thank you so much. I just hit 400 subscribers. Thanks to everybody who follows my Instagram, who's supporting my YouTube channel. And uh, I can't wait to uh, do more reviews for you guys. Anyways, like always, stay clean.